On my dive the other day, I almost saw this sea turtle get caught on this fishing line. I started to clean it up, but it was a lot more than I realized. I cleaned it off the coral on one end, but then realized that the string was going really far in another direction also. What you don't see in this video is that every time I pull it off a coral head, I have to go back up to the surface to get some air. This is about 30 or 40 feet deep, so it's really difficult to get it off. Just to get these last few bits took me about 30 minutes, but I finally found the end. I hooked it all together so that I could bring it back to shore. On our way back, we finally found the cave that we were looking for. We found it in the exact moment that this turtle swam into it. It was so lucky. We swam in it for a little bit, but honestly, I was so tired from pulling up the fishing line that I was ready to go home. Then I found this on the way back. When I was looking at it, I was like, wow, that looks like a bag of concrete. And then I tried to pull it up and it was literally a bag of concrete. How does this get out here? Then Brittany found this really cool shell. Ooh. Ooh. Yay, pretty shell. Nice find, Brittany. I don't know if you can tell, but I have major goosebumps. I got so cold out there. If you want to know more about the fishing line that was out there endangering sea turtles, I put up a YouTube video explaining it.